Okay, everybody. So we are making a double batch of my world famous vegan dulce de leche fruit dip. You let that sink in for a second. It's dulce de leche, but there's the leche is coconut milk, so it's vegan friendly. And like all my recipes, it's gluten free. Doing a double batch here. Um, the recipe originally comes from the Happy Hungry Journey Girls website. So it's in my ebook cookbook for teen girls. But you can find the website as well over at happyhungryjourney.com. So the recipe I'm making today is approximately doubled of what you'll find over there. I'm The dip also doubles as a really great frosting for birthday cakes, which is what I'm making for a friend today. So I'm, the usual recipe calls for about 10 to 12 dates. I'm going to start here with about, mm, what do we have here? I think I cut up 22 or 24-ish. All right. Uh, you know I'm not a big fan of measuring. Uh, on the website, I think it said something like six tablespoons of maple syrup. Um, I'm just going to dump in half the container. I know. There you go. That's going to be amazing. Like, you're not going to believe this when you see how it comes out. Let's see. Uh, I'm going to do about two-thirds of a container of creamy almond butter. Do, 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 do. I'll mix everything up, and at the end, if we need more, I'll pour more in. Yes. Yes. Okay. A splash of vanilla. Okay, that was a little more than a splash. Um, let's see, I have three quarters of a cup coconut milk here. I'm going to just do a little, not all of it, because remember, you can always add in, you can't take out. And just like, salt makes food taste more like itself. So just a couple cracks of salt. Let's see what happens. going on in here. Uh, it needs more almond butter. So I'm just going to put the rest of the almond butter in. It's possible that I might even need to open up the next container of almond butter, but we'll see. We'll see in a second. Mm, good to know when I'm, I'm doubling this batch for the first time, so we'll see. Okay. Let's see what happens. food processor is basically telling me it's had enough. Oh my god. That is so beautiful. I'm just going to put in a little more splash of milk to help it blend. Let's see. Like cooking, you know, it's always like a science experiment. Let's see. Yeah, give it a second, it'll get going. Okay. Mmm. That is so beautiful.
So what you ended up not seeing, I had a little bit of technical difficulties there, not with the camera, but with the food processor. I ended up um, pouring in, um, so total, it's an entire container of creamy almond butter. Oh my God. So you can eat this like dip strawberries in it all by itself. Um, as soon as I turn this off, I'm probably going to eat this right off the spoon. It also doubles as a really great um, icing for a, a, a chocolate cake, for example. I'm putting this onto a chocolate ganache cake. All right. Hmm. Excited to hear your comments. Uh, let me know how it comes out for you. I hope you love it.